Welcome back everyone to another Foxtech video. This time we talk about how to clear app data on iPhone. Now this is very specific for individual apps, unlike on Androids where you just find the clear cache and clear data for every app in the settings. On iPhone, we need to check out the settings of specific apps. For example, when you go to TikTok and you go to your account, and then click on the settings, I believe that you should have the ability to click um, the free up space button and essentially you can clear cache or downloads on your device. So that's pretty useful, but it only works when a specific app has that available. So always just check it out in the settings, for example, on TikTok, Instagram, or other apps, if it's available and if it is, you can just clear cache and clear app data very simply. But as I say, not available on every single app. However, there is always the option to just hold down on the app and just click on a delete, remove, and just delete it from the iPhone and then reinstall it back again, which is obviously going to clear out the app data. Uh, and you can start fresh. So that's something which you can also do. And one more interesting setting is called offloading the app, which is, which can be found in the general and then iPhone storage section. And essentially when you found, find an app, you have the ability to delete it as well as to offload it. And well, it's kind of different because what it does, offloading literally just keeps the app data, which we want to clear, but it like lifts up or say um, freeze up some of the uh, storage on your iPhone, but not by removing the app data, but by removing the actual app installation file, right? So when you click on offload, you can see that it's going to keep the 2.6 gigs of documents and data, but it's going to remove the app size, which I can get back from the app store and just continue my thing. So that's all I wanted to say. Hope you found this video helpful. Hit the thumbs up if you like it, subscribe for more, and I'll see you in the next one.